Good morning children. How are you? It will be a while that we got a chance to speak to each other face to face. We know the situation is like this. So there is less opportunity. Let me tell you a story today. Once a teacher decided to conduct a fun activity in her class. She asked the students to draw a picture of the most beautiful thing they have seen. The students start to draw the pictures. As they were drawing, teacher went to them and she was looking at the picture of each and every one of them. Some was drawing a flower, some was drawing a picture of a, a scenery, some was uh, drawing a picture of a starry night. But when she come near the student who was a most troublesome student in her class, he was drawing a picture of a face. Actually, it was a bit of ugly face because the lips were bigger and uh, tooth were big. So it was not proportionate and looks somewhat ugly. First teacher thought that he was making a mockery of the activity. Anyway, teacher wanted to know his version about the picture. She asked him, who is this? His reply was, ma'am, it is you. She got perplexed. She asked him, Again, am I looking so bad? And his reply was really nice. He said, no ma'am, I'm trying to draw a picture of your face with a smile. Because you are the only person who smiles when you see me. While all others turn their face when they see me. It was only my mother who used to smile when she see me. And she is no more. So for a while, this is the most beautiful picture. Oh, the most beautiful thing I'm seeing for a while. That's why I'm drawing your face. See, a teacher can influence us just with a caring smile or a loving pat on the shoulder or with a correcting look. In many ways, a teacher influences a student. When I listen to the word teacher, there is a face which comes to my mind. She was a teacher of me when I was studying in the high school. She was not the most uh, encouraging, caring or a courteous teacher towards me. Probably she was the strictest teacher I ever had during my school years. She was never happy with my marks, my grades or my efforts, irrespective of how much I school. She always wanted more. Yet it is her face which comes to my mind when I listen to the word teacher. It is due to the fact that I realize she understood my potential as a student when I was studying. And she had a big hand in me or for what I become now. So that's why I remember her face. I'm sure you will have few faces of your teachers coming into your mind when I'm saying this. It's the same. They are the one who touched your lives. They are the one who affected you as a person and corrected or mentored you as a better person. Teacher is not a person who just imparts information. She mentors us. They guide us through our learning process. They try to correct our character. All in all, they help us to be a better person. A good teacher always, always care to mentor their students to be a better person. That is the specialty of a teacher. Now, let us take this time just to be thankful for the care and guidance they give us. For the effort they show to mentor us to be a better person in our life. And let us work hard to be a better person in our life. Thank you very much 